okay at the end of our SEO copywriting series here at the end we're going to add this featured image and if you scroll right over here to the uh, right sidebar here you can see where to add the featured image all of these things can be moved around the page or this is where it is and I'll go ahead and remove that featured image so I can show you how to add one now what I do is I use Canva and I have a bunch of templates in Canva. Let me open this and show you. And so what I have is, this is my real estate, well actually let me go down here, here we go. There's my Lori Ballin template and it has all of the colors that are on part of that brand. And here I have my real estate team web uh, image and I have all the colors that match that brand. And here I have my IDX broker, blog posts, I have my brew template, see there where it says brew template, and um, the green is my infusion soft. So this is how I can easily keep up on my templates now. And so let's just say I want to, I'm doing an infusion soft blog and I want to use that template. All I do is go up here to the right arrow and I'm going to click make a copy. And then once the copy is there right here, I just click to open it. And then I would change the title. So let's just say the title said, um, keeping a record of communication, something like that. Okay. Then I'm going to delete the old picture and I can just kind of drag this to where I want it to be. And if it's too big, I can change the size of the font. So much fun stuff I can do here with with this it makes everything really easy. I can put more spacing between those lines if I wanted to. Okay. So then I need an icon that has something to do with communication. So I would put communication up here and then I'm going to drop this arrow down and say, only show me free things. Oh yeah, this is great. And I'm going to look and see which one I think works for my blog. And I'm going to drag that over there. So everything has a title and an icon, and then I want to get those to fit a little better there. I think I'll do one smaller. There we go. Keeping a record of communication. Let me see if I can make that any bigger now. There, that's better. So I just kind of play with that until I get it. And that's all there is to making a featured image here for the Infusionsoft, the IDX broker, the Lori Ballin is completely easy. The real estate side takes a little bit more creativity. I got to go look up a, an image that has a house or has information about the neighborhood. But these other three are super, super simple. So I'm going to go ahead and I would just download that and that would be my image. So I'd go over here, set featured image. And then I'm going to choose upload files, select files, and then I'm going to browse for um, an image that I just created. And so something like this might work, the one I just did. I'm going to open that. And then I, once that's in there, I'm going to optimize the image. So it already has a title. Now I'm going to describe what the image is about for somebody that would be visually impaired. So I'm going to put something like branded image has an icon of a camera plus information about contacting Lori Ballin and the banner letters spell out copy writing step 10 image something like that and then you're going to click set featured image and it'll be in there i'm not going to do it since we're not actually editing this blog post in fact i should go back there and that would be the final step in this series of seo copywriting for your for our wordpress websites so i hope you got a lot out of this training